Hi everyone. Hi everybody. In today's video, we are going to be um, trying this brand, Morgan Taylor. I've never tried it before. And one of the viewers requested us to test this. So mm -hmm. that's what we're doing. Yes. So this is no light extended wear base coat and no light extended wear top coat. What and do you mean by no light? Yeah, because it's kind of like the gel. I oh. guess they're a version of gel, but it's obviously not a gel. It's nail polish. That's they could have just said nail lasting. polish. Yeah, long lasting, right? So, okay. So, again, never tried it. Uh, it's supposed to last 10 days or so. So, we'll see how that goes. And we did a manicure already. So, we're just going to do the application of the color. We wiped the nails with prep so they're nice and clean. You know, the brushes are good, but I don't think they're as good as uh, the Essie. Ooh. Something about them. Oops. Pretty stinky. Stinky. Eh? It could be a good thing. But it's like the, the type of stinky where you privately just want to take it and go huff it in the corner. Kind of <laughs> thing, you know? Okay, there is fluffy just, here. How about you just give me that yeah. I'll be right back in about five minutes. Yeah. It's kind of a, yeah, it's, it's uh, I don't it's know. It's kind of weird. It's like that thing you would, you know, go huff in the corner in your spare time. Oh my God. That explains a lot. What? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah. so there's fluffies on this, yeah. but. Okay, so this is pretty thin. Obviously it's brand new product. Yeah. Um, so it's going to be thin. What else can I say about it? Not much. It applies well. And looks, we're going to try... You know, like it seems... Yeah, good. decent. Yeah. So we're going to do... Uh, well, he's going to wear it for 10 days because I think they say that it, it lasts for 10 days. So we'll, we'll, we'll test it. Oh, yes. And... Um, yeah. Let me just wipe this again. want to make sure there's no dust on the nails and you know what this is interesting as you can see there is some like dryness because we did quite a lot of uh, gel polish and then after that we did a couple IB ibx treatments which really really helped but after a few more removals it's almost like that ibx treatment is gone out of the nail so and that's what i noticed so it's not like a permanent kind of fixed solution so you kind of have to do it on a regular basis until the the um, nail, the damaged part grows out. So the IBX kind of reinforces the the nail as it grows out, so more damage is not created. But also, apparently, also Morgan Tyler. Tyler Taylor, Taylor 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 has um, like a treat keratin treatment for the nails as well, so I have to buy it as well to test it. Mm -hmm. I have to do a video about all these products because they're kind of interesting and share with you guys which one of them are better than others. He's like literally sniffing his nails. Are you gonna be able to drive home? <laughs> What? You're gonna be able to drive. You'll home. have to call me a cab. Yeah. Okay, so this is more gray than purple. And the bottle looks more pur purple. I was kind of scared. Honestly, it looks very purple from yeah. the inside. And when you said, well, you're gonna be wearing this for the next, you know, 10 days, I went, okay. Okay, well, it's kind of purple. Okay, but, uh, so this is the. Did I say what name that was? No. S sweater. I can't sweater remember. weather. Sweater weather. Sweater oh. weather. I feel you did, actually. And oh, really? Yeah, say that fast, like 10 times. Yeah. All right, so. Let's see how it is. But I may be wrong. Perhaps I've huffed my fingers far too long. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure. Okay, let's Ooh. test this. I'm gonna shake it up a little bit more. Did you uh, give it the shaker treatment? Polishes are usually, unless they're severely um, separated, they don't, usually they're easier to kind of um, shake. You know what, the, the um, They're easier to shake. They're easier to mix, yes. 
Um, what was I going to say? Okay, it sets up kind of pretty fast. The, this thing is too wide for me. I prefer when the, oh. the it's, it feels weird. My the first coat kind of, it seems a little thin. Yeah, it's, well, it's a brand new bottle too. Yeah. So it's going to apply very thin. But like streaky thin. Oh, that's not bad. Tell that's my pinky. Yeah, because you know what? Um, especially when, if you have a base coat underneath and you put a pressure on the first coat of polish, it kind of uh, does that. Mm -hmm. That's why I usually prefer to use the colors that, the brands that don't have a base coat. I find that the uh, application of the first coat is better. Right. Okay, so far so so good. Very good, I have to say. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and we're gonna give it, um, you know, um, a dry test. What's the dry time look? Uh, yeah, I don't know. Oh, I have to this try. is an unknown factor. Yeah. Ooh, how exciting! As you can see, I've really <laughs> prepared for this video. Well, we just picked What's up the, the name? I don't know. <laughs> we just picked this up today. Yes, this is true. But, you know, I had time to read about it, which I didn't. It's a surprise. Do you even remember who suggested it? No. Tisk tisk. Mm -hmm. So these polishes are available at... Um, Cosmoprof for the professionals, but also Sally Beauty for the non-professionals. So it's wildly available. Well, it seems particularly odd that it would be considered a professional only product. No, no, it's not it's, only, but like... No, but I mean, like a place like, say, Cosmoprof, for instance. Oh. Like you have to have a Cosmoprof Well, card. to get a discount. To get a professional discount. Oh, and I thought that was also here. just a purchase in general. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They don't have. Uh, they don't sell to non-professional. Yeah. Right. And that's why I was. I was kind of saying like it just seems a little odd. However. You no, know, it's a professional only place. So did I touch this one? Not really. Okay, so let's see how this first coat looks. It has like this kind of a bluish tinge to it. Okay, so this feels quite dry. Okay. Mm, impressive. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know much about this brand. I don't know how many colors they have. Okay, so it dries more blue. Yeah, it, right? it applies very it's gray, gray it but then it dries more mm -hmm. blue purple. Yeah. I think I like the blue, I mean the gray better. Yeah, the initial application mm -hmm. looks really good. I mean, that's yeah. not to say it's a bad color. It's just, it's just you're gonna the initial purple. application looks really good. And then it just kind of, well, not quite to my taste. Personally, yes. Oh. You're gonna wear it for ten days now. I guess I stuck. am. Hooray! Mm -hmm. Okay, that that is very quick. I would say. Good. Dry. Like dazzle dry quick or? No, nothing is like dazzle dry. <laughs> Okay. Uh, what else were we going to talk about? Awkward silence. Um, <coughs> Sorry. Maybe I can play some music. Okay, the application is very, very good. I have to say, these are very ridgy nails. 
Yeah, also the application is uh, really nice. Okay, so do you know the name? So Jellish, you know Jellish, right? The yes. company? Um, I guess Danny Hale, who's the, the founder of the brand, mm -hmm. has two kids. One is Morgan, and then the other one is Taylor. Really? Mm -hmm. And that's how that came to be? Yeah. I see. I'm not a fan of Jellish, I have to say, at all. Of their gel polish. It's not easy to uh, remove and just generally uh, not not a fan. Um, but I mean, we'll, well see as how far this. As their yeah. polish is concerned. So thus far, so good. So far, yeah. so good. Yeah. So I'm gonna quickly clean this up. I mean, it's pretty pretty good. But so I'm dipping the uh, brush in acetone, pure acetone, and. So we're just gonna time it and see how long it takes to kind of set on the second coat. Clean oh, yeah, so we have easy. a top coat to go along. Yeah, and a top coat as well. Right. Listen to him complain. Someone's painting your nails for free. You're complaining. And I'm giving you the most precious commodity. <laughs> my time. Yeah, that's true. I take it back. Ah. <laughs> Oops, that was my stomach. Oh, I thought that was mine. Um, okay, so I wanted to talk very quickly about the fundraiser that we're doing. Yes. We are at $537, I believe, and we're trying to raise 1000 um to um, help... Carlota Galgos, which is a sanctuary, a, um, a greyhound galgo rescue uh, place in Malaga, Spain. And they rehabilitate and find homes for galgos, which are Spanish greyhounds. And they're amazing. And I visited them last year, well, 2019 in September. Um, so I know they're a super legit place and they're doing amazing work. Um, I'm going to leave a link below for you guys to check it out. And once we raise a thousand dollars, he's going to wear um, like a bright pink manicure and take pictures of himself. Well, wearing the nails, the nails, <laughs> not pictures of yourself. No, no. That came, <laughs> came really out a little. Odd. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> he's gonna take pictures of himself. <laughs> okay, no. No, no. No, that's not going to happen. No. I mean, if that's His what nails. you're really looking for, <laughs> listen, you sorry. can always, it's you know, the wrong wake up. Place. You know, overweight, hairy men on the internet, and I'm sure there's a, a, a plethora of, of pictures that will show up. So, oh god, that's that's uh, gives you general. No, idea it's pictures with. of his nails uh, around right. town. That's what I was going to yes. say. Yes. <laughs> okay, this pictures is really good. Well. <laughs> My goodness. Yeah, no, no. And for those but, of you who got super excited, the idea that you might have actually you'd have the opportunity to see my face—that's not going to happen. No, we're not into that stuff. Okay, so this is that pretty just, pretty dry. <laughs> I know, you know, I should just, okay. This you video and I'm, yeah. You need to stop. Uh, for those of you who are new to the channel, hi, how are you? This is how weird things get. Yeah. Please like and subscribe. <sighs> okay, so where are we top coat? Uh, React top coat. I'm just gonna roll it. So this is three minutes. I kind of give them three minutes. Um, you know, if you have time, it's better. Uh, Not bad, it's kind of dry. Like, you know. I think there's some smudges, but yeah. Yeah. Right on. It's kind of impressive, actually. Mm -hmm. I'm sure your work is going to be uh, very impressed that you again have nail polish on because you kind of had probably a month or so without a nail polish. Oh, that's They right. probably thought that you gave up and you're like, no, no. No, it's not going to happen. Anytime soon. If any of my bosses are watching, Hello. this isn't going to stop. Get used to it. And I love you. I like being employed, so I say this with uh, with all the happiness and, and my positivity heart. in the world. So I'm not sure how this is going to, how this should be applied. If it should be applied thick or thin or whatever. Well, we'll find out. We'll find out. Yeah. Okay, this well, applies very well. Very well, yeah. I have to say. It has this odd cooling sensation I can feel oh, really? through right now. Yeah, it's kind of neat. Oh, maybe your nails are breathing. <laughs> 
<laughs> they need some maybe extra oxygen feel, right now. Maybe you're feeling the lungs. Um, I, I can feel them as they're breathing in and breathing out. <laughs> Fully in. With the breath. <laughs> Good old Wim Hof. Love that guy. Yeah, if you guys are interested in doing some meditation and like some super helpful exercises, check him out, Wim Hof. Yeah. Pro he is like my hero. Yeah. Between him and Neil deGrasse Tyson, those are like like two of my biggest heroes. Okay, the brushes are good, but they're kind of a little weird at the same time. All of them they're or just, just this one in particular? I don't know. They're kind of like, you see splitting a little bit. Okay, so then it's all of them, or at least the ones that you currently yeah. use, which is now three. Well, the polish was better. Well, they're they're very shiny. The nails? And very, yes. Yeah, they are. Oh, yeah. Like, they're... Okay, and we could... Oh. And we it's... might have stumbled upon something good. Watch, I mean, tomorrow it's all chipped off and scratched to hell. <laughs> hey. Did I just touch it? Yeah, you did. Oh, I felt that. Shoot. 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 Not, not shish kabibble. It's 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 a different consistency. As you can see, I kind of have to adjust my technique. Your technique. Yeah, it sets up pretty fast. And, uh, I didn't even notice that you had to adjust your technique, to yes. be perfectly frank. What did I do? You know, I didn't... Where did I touch it? What? It doesn't show. You touched it? I know. I felt you touch it. You, I know you wow. know that, that okay. you touched it. So I've been polishing this for like two minutes. So this has been drying for two minutes. Uh, but you know, is there a reason you were beating know, right? me with that? So let's just uh, start again the drying process and let's give it. I'm gonna actually look on the internet how long this is supposed to dry and uh, we'll be right back. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so this is eight minutes and let's see. It looks very shiny and very full. Mm -hmm. Looks almost like gel polish. But it's still early. Oh my god. That doesn't feel tacky. Wow. It actually feels quite very dry. Oh my Dental. god. Dental. Not, not really. Just... It's kind of, yeah, but you know, yeah, it kind of dented a little bit. Oh. oh my god, just a little bit. But it feels very, very good. I'm not going to spray it, to be honest with you. Yeah. Wow. Like, I'm. Mm -hmm. Okay, very quickly, I'm going to read to you what, what it says. Oh, uh, you know what? This one feels kind of... A little bit? Yeah. Okay. So it says, what is it? Breakthrough shine and wear without investing in an entirely new color line. Patent pending gelish infused technology. Whatever that means, gelish infused. No, it doesn't have gel in it. Blah, blah, blah. Technology bonds with nail lacquer for up to 10 days. Up to 10 days. So, you know, five is also up to, but whatever. I will we'll destroy it in the three. <laughs> uh, for our React based top base coat provides radical color adhesion radical uh while react top coat seals the deal with chip resistance that outshines the rest what makes it so special no light extended wear and base top coat with gelish infused technology radical color adhesion and chip resistant for up to 10 days outstanding shine that cannot be matched used with any lacquer you already own dry to touch in eight minutes soak free removal Okay, so apparently you can use this with any other brand. Mm, whatever. I wouldn't. Well, you could, but it's not. That, yeah. That's not necessarily going to provide you with optimal results. I would say, yeah, I would say I would be careful with that. Yeah. So, um, you know what? We're going to do the. I'm just trying to find ingredients. Just a quick look at it. Okay, here. Ten ingredients, uh, how to use. Okay, hold on. Alcohol it has alcohol, it just have lots. Maybe that's why it felt kind of cold. How to use base coat, two coats, finish with pro tips. 
yeah, we'll use with any nail lacquer you already own. Prep, 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 yes, which is true. Proper nail preparation is key with any successful manicure. Move excess oils on the nail plate before getting started. Cup the free edge for lasting manicure. All right, so that's at Sally's Beauty. They carry it. All right, so we will be back in 10 days to show you the results of this manicure, and mm -hmm. we will update you on Patreon. I usually do like an update. In a day or two. In a day or two. Or five. So far, thumbs up. It looks mm -hmm. very, very good. Very good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Can't okay. Blame there. So thank you so much for watching, and... uh Thank you for watching. <laughs> Bye. Ciao.